Did your mom ever tell you the same thing my mom told me? Stand up straight, don't slouch. They were pretty wise. I don't necessarily think that they meant it for golf, but today we're going to talk about the massive importance to have good posture in your golf swing is. Hi, Jeff Cavanetti coming to you from the Launch Kitchen here. It's December wintertime and it's a great time of year to work on your game. So today what I want to talk to you about is your posture and your posture with an iron specifically and then with a driver and how that relates to the golf swing and why it's so important. Okay. So the first thing that I've seen so many people do is when I work with them at first on their setup, immediately I see them bend this way and their shoulders slouch. Their hips stay in and their shoulders come down here like this. What we want to do is this. This is a great drill and you can do this at home in your living room. Take the club, put it on your back. Okay, This club will be touching you in two points. It will be touching you at your tailbone and it will be touching you in the middle of your back when you're standing up straight. With your feet shoulder width apart, what you're going to do is you're going to bend at the waist. Notice that I don't bend at my shoulders, but I bend at the waist. And if I do it right, this club stays touching me in those two points. You can see how the club is flat on my back right here. If I do it the wrong way, you can see how I get this big curve in my spine. So getting your hips back or just putting your butt back like this, bending at the waist is very, very important. Okay. From here, what we're going to do is we're going to simply let our arms relax, drop in front of us. Okay. If I bend at the waist like this, I've now given myself room in which to swing my arms. Okay. If I'm here like this, I don't have room for my arms and now I have to reach with my arms like this. And I see a lot of people do that. You'll never see that one great player throughout the history of the game have bad posture. Now they all look a little bit differently because we're all built differently. So I'm not saying we all have to look exactly the same, but to bend at the waist is a huge fundamental. Now the other thing that having good posture is going to do for us is this. It's going to help us stand the proper distance from the golf ball. I get that question a lot, is how far away should I be standing? Well, if I get into the same posture every single time and I just let the club drop in front of me where my arms are hanging here like this, that club's going to drop in the same spot. I'm not going to have to feel like i got to reach for it or maybe it should be in here like this. If my arms drop and they're relaxed, I'm going to put it in the same spot every time. Okay. Same thing as if I take a driver here now. All right. Now, if I get into that same posture and I just let my arms drop, Naturally, I'll be standing away from the ball further only because why? This club is longer. So I let the, the length of the club dictate how far I'm standing from the golf ball. So that's why having good posture is very, very important. Last thing, I just want to tell you this. With posture, once we get into that posture, it's important that we're going to try to stay in that posture, okay? So I see a lot of people, when they stand up, they lose their posture, okay? Or maybe you've seen someone do this and they kind of dip down, they lose that posture. So again, if we put that club on our back and we just swing and keep that same spine angle, same posture, it's going to give us a lot better chance to make better contact um, in the swing with all clubs. So again, posture, do that, practice it. Something great that you can do in the wintertime, especially this time of year when you can't hit golf balls in your living room, snowy January evening, anytime you can do it. All right. For more tips like this, please come see me, Jeff Caminetti at Maple Hill. Have a great day.